Hi, I'm Harrison, and I'm going to help you get started using your Echo Live Scribe pen and notebook. Okay, so here we have our pen and our notebook. Now the first thing we want to do is take the little protective casing off the tip of the pen so that we can actually write with it. There we are. And we're just going to turn the pen on with the little power button at the top here. Just click it and it'll boot right up. Okay, so now that we've turned on the pen, we have to set our orientation whether we're right-handed or left-handed. To do that, we'll just open up the notebook and right over here on the first page, there's a little section right here that tells you whether to set it to your right hand or left hand. All you have to do is tap your choice. I'm right-handed, so I will just tap the right one and it will set my display to being right-handed. Now there's a whole conglomeration of other features on this page here, but we'll get into that later. For now, let's just start writing. So we'll skip ahead a couple pages. I already wrote some stuff on the first page, so we'll get a clean page here. Now it's very easy to just start writing. The pen will automatically tell what you're writing and catch it, and when you import it to your computer later, you can see it. So, all you have to do to start writing is, well, start writing. Okay, so now if you want to record audio and write at the same time, you're going to focus on this little left-hand corner of the page right here. These three buttons are where you're going to be using most. The record button, the pause button, and the stop button. To start recording, just hit the record button, start writing and talking, and when you're done, hit stop. The little screen that shows that it's starting to record and here we go I can say whatever I want whilst it's going and when I'm done I'll just hit stop and it shows you the full audio file there 14 seconds long and that's how you record audio while writing now say you want to go back and hear your different paper replays so, what we're going to do for that is the little nav bar here. If you hit the center of it, it'll go straight to your menu. And we'll go to Paper Replay. That's the first option. We'll hit the right arrow. That'll bring us forward one. Now we can choose to record a new session. We can go down to play a session. That's what we want. We'll hit the right arrow. And we can select which session we want. I have several in here. So I can select whichever one I want. I'll just go down. And I'll do the one that I did today, and we'll hit the right arrow, and it starts playing. And I can use the same buttons here to pause and stop. So I'll just pause it, and we're all good to go. Now if I do want to skip ahead, if say it's a really long note, I can use this little scrub bar over here to jump to a different position in the audio. The door. Earlier, the beginning, and the end. I'll hit stop again. And that's another way to hear your notes. Now say you want to add new notes to something you already recorded and wrote notes to. So I already recorded audio and I have written the notes here. So say I want to add a couple more notes to the same audio. So all you have to do is tap on your notes and start writing again. So I'll tap here. And, here we go. and maybe I'll just do a couple I can say whatever O's. I going. And then I'll just hit stop. And when I import that, it will then include those new O's with the same audio and the original notes. It won't record any new audio, but you'll have extra stuff to read while you're listening. And there you go. You're recording and writing with your LiveScribe Echo Pen, just like that. Now one last thing. If you did want to just record audio with no notes, you can take your pen and just hold down the power button until a recording screen pops up. We'll do that. And there we go. Now we can record whatever we want, and when we're done, just hit it again, and you're all good to go. Happy live scribing!